Alongside UVA Wise men's and women's cross country coach Donald Leach, his team's headed down, or up rather, this weekend to Berea for its second meet of the season. Coach, before we get to talk about uh, Berea this weekend, we'll look back on last week at Montreal. The weather made that a little bit more uh, difficult footing than I guess what you anticipated. Oh, it was very rough conditions. We had very high levels of heat and humidity um, combined with mud that was sticky in parts, slick in parts, and when you're trying to run three or five miles through nothing but mud in high heat and humidity, it's very brutal conditions. It had some effects. Coach, uh, I guess it's the same story for both the women and the men. You had some, some pretty, pretty good runners who, who, who fared well, and then there was a drop off. Uh, you're just looking for a little bit more depth and consistency. Yes, uh, both teams, uh, our top three runners performed extremely well. And then uh, with the guys, we have some younger runners who I think over time will fill the gap. Uh, with the women's team, the conditions produce some injuries to a couple of key runners. These injuries are short term, fortunately, but that forced them to drop back and drop off the pace. They should be healthy at Berea, and I'm looking for a really good rebound from the women's team this week. Coach, looking at Berea, what type of course will we see this week? Uh, Berea is a fun course. It's fair. It's flatter than Montreal, which my runners all like. A uh, mixture of fields and woods. The I think the highlight of that course is they have to cross a stream twice out and back, and that's always a good classic cross country challenge. Splashing through a stream. Coach, last week down at Montreal, uh, we saw schools, everything from Division One schools in Appalachian State to some NAIA schools. What's the competition going to be like this week? This will be a mix of NAIA and Division Two. Um, again, and a good mix of competition within that level. Some very good, high-quality schools down through, you know, some of the schools still developing. So a good mix of competition. Coach, I know we asked you this last week, but we'll ask again. Unlike some of the other sports who leave the night before, I'm assuming again you're traveling on the day of the competition. Yes, our races are mid-morning, and we find logistically it's just easy to leave around six o'clock in the morning. Students sleeping on the bus and uh, get there in time, uh, an hour before the race to prepare. That's UVA Wise Men's and Women's Cross Country Coach Donald Leach. His teams will be at Berea this weekend and you can find the results on uvawisecavs.com.